Wells were put in place for environmental compliance, but they were also put in for odor control. And as we continue to develop the landfill, we were putting in additional phases so that we could control the odors that were coming off of the landfill. And, uh, and so right now, everything has simply been flared. Now we're going to be able to beneficially reuse that gas. The gas plant here uh, involves compressing the gas initially, removing hydrogen sulfide, which is common in landfill gas. And, uh, and then we do a, a bulk CO2 removal. We remove the CO2 from the gas, so we're, we take basically just the methane and sell that methane. Then the gas is compressed and sent to the pipeline. And in this area, it will be going into Atmos uh, Pipeline, Texas. We will be moving that gas through their system as part of the renewable fuel program at the EPA. And so we will be taking that gas and using it as vehicle fuel. We're going to receive a royalty from, the, from Moro for, the, uh, for the, the gas that they are using. And that will generate somewhere initially on the order of about a half a million dollars a year of revenue for us or offsetting costs. And so though, that will allow us to reduce um, our overall costs that we have for our solid waste member cities.